Hey guys, welcome back to Zach Blog. So, I've had this uh, pink 3D printed skull sitting around the shop for quite a while. It's printed in uh, hot pink Solutec uh, filament, PLA, and I kind of want to see if I can weather this thing. So, what we're going to do today is throw a coat of primer on it, and then paint it up a nice off-white and use some brown and see if we can make this thing look like it's been dug out of the ground. So let's go! Alright, so we've got everything set up here. We've got the skull. Uh, got a cup of water. Shot glass. I don't have any thinners, so I'm just going to use some rum. Uh, primer. Cream colored acrylic and espresso colored acrylic, some brushes, and some toilet paper. So, let's get started. I'm just going to grab some primer and start slapping it on. This isn't like a self-leveling primer or anything, so... Oh, uh, this may not turn out great. We'll just see what happens. It's an experiment after all. Probably gonna have to do a few coats of this anyway. Try and fill in what I can. Might sand it down in between. Anyway, gonna speed this footage up for you guys. the first coat. It's all nice and dry. It's not greatest, but that's why we're doing a bunch of coats. So, let's get working on the next coat. Okay, so now we have the primer coats done. Just a little bit of pink showing through here and there, but I think the actual paint will cover that up, so no problem. So we're going to be using just some cheap acrylic paint from the dollar store. It's a bit of an off-white called cream, because I figure a skull is not going to be perfectly white. And then after that, we're going to let that dry a bit and use this espresso to weather it and hopefully make it look like it's been dug up out of the ground a bit. So, let's go. Okay, so we got a coats of white on there. I kind of started going on with the brown a little bit. In the teeth a little bit there. So now I'm gonna hit this with the sponge a bit and see if we can make it look like it came out of the ground. So here's the skull after some brown. Looks alright. Not quite as good as I wanted. So I went back to the dollar store and I picked up some black. We're basically just going to do the same thing. Dab some on with a sponge and wipe it off.
All right. So after adding the black, now we've got much deeper shadows in the eyes and in the nose, all around the teeth, jawline. You can see in some places some pink is showing through. It's kind of a cheap primer, so probably should have done a few more coats, but oh well, I'm happy with it. Alright guys, so this has been a quick look at my first attempt at weathering and, or painting and weathering a 3D print. I think it turned out pretty good. The skull looks awesome as far as I'm concerned. Uh, guess that's pretty much it for today. If you guys liked the video, hit like. If you disliked it, hit dislike. Leave a comment. Uh, click that subscribe button for more. I've recently started a Patreon account. So if you guys actually want to support the channel at all, you can do so over there. I'll leave a link in the description. And I guess that's it. Have a good one, guys.